here we are. Long time coming. Uh, what do you think? Oh gosh, I'm just, you know, I'm so glad we're finally at the end of this process. You, you, we believed it was gonna be okay and obviously we heard positive things, but to have it actually come to a 32 to nothing vote is, is really exciting. And I'm just so excited for Jacksonville about what comes next. You've talked through this process about being from Jacksonville, knowing the story. <laughs> How satisfying is it uh, for you on that front? Well, you know, it's so funny. I was thinking about it earlier, how from the, from the night sitting on that anchor desk, watching us get this team to this moment where we have the opportunity, where, where I have an opportunity to be a part of keeping this team in Jacksonville for 30 years and creating this incredible space for downtown. Um, it's just, it's an amazing feeling, and I'm so proud and grateful for Jacksonville. It's, it's an amazing night. There have been people over the years that didn't believe in Jacksonville and have an NFL team in Jacksonville. What does it mean to hear that it was a unanimous vote, 32 to nothing? Well, it's just such a vote of confidence. And the truth is, you know, that's my message. That I've always had that same message. We have to believe in ourselves. And I think that night that we got the team, Jacksonville got that first signal that we are a can-do city. And I think this just shows that we are still a can-do city and we're going to do great things. What's next? for the city in, in this process? Or is this kind of, okay, everything's good, now it, the Jags take over? Um, well, no, what's, what's next is we get this stadium built. You know, we're, we're just a couple of months away from commencing construction on this stadium. So that will, that will take all of us working together to make that happen. And um, I, I'm, I can't wait to put those shovels in the ground and get started. It's gonna be a long four years. Well, you know, we'll, we'll miss having the Jaguars there during the times they're not there. I think that's going to be the toughest part for our city because people will hate not having them there. But we, we know it, it, it's for a good purpose and we'll have them back soon. Thank you. Thank you.